an idea, Mr. Jordan. Couldn't we have him reborn? Oh no, come on, Jonas, don't turn freaky now. Okay, 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 I'm... Jesus Christ, I really hate that. But I'm... I think, um... What is it... Like, what does it feel like when that happens? Is you forget stuff, really. Like what you're supposed to be doing, or... I usually forget my dad's name to start. And then it snowballs into not remembering how to walk or talk, and... But you, like, see stuff, right? Like, when I saw Michael on the beach, Yeah, and I, you... I see stuff, but it's like, I don't know, they're like dreams. They just dissolve when I'm back. Look, it's scary, needless to say, when I, like, drown or whatever in my own body, and it's starting to feel like... just... like, how do I say this? Because I don't want to... It's okay, Jonas. Just say what's on your brain. I just want to say... I just... I think it would have been cool, us living together for... for whatever, senior year. And I'm just... glad I met you, that's all. Oh, Jonas, you big sap. Okay, all right, that's all, nothing to see here. And now we can go back to the whole escaping and trying to live another day thing. Yeah, let's finish strong now. No half-acidness at the end. I guess Maggie was the one who had this place turned into a park. Okay, I'm, gonna, I'm just gonna say one thing, and then I promise it'd be the last time I bring it up tonight, but... You know you screwed up with Ashley at the concert, right? I mean, it's not a giant thing, but still. Who's Ash... Oh, you mean Amanda? My really good friend Amanda who's moving away forever? That Amanda? Yeah, that Amanda, who stole her mom's car. And I don't care if you didn't know she didn't have permission to take it, cause whatever, fine. But you knew you didn't have permission to go to that show. Just tell me it's the last time I hear about you stealing a car. However inadvertently, my little heart can't handle the excitement. Mm, nope, not promising that. What's the point in living if not to boost cars for an underworld criminal empire? I guess I can't answer that. Oh, and I wanted to say, um, <laughs> per your advice, I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna really, um, like, commit to Clarissa. <laughs> that sounds dumb, like I'm pinning her or something. But you, you know what I mean. Uh, maybe think about that for, like, a little bit. Oh my god, you sound like my guy friends. Play the field! I like her, Alex. I like her a lot. I don't want her to get away, so get used to her. Come on, let's get to the sentry before the last boat comes. I gotta get the, uh, visual aid for the history project. And then I just gotta write the stupid essay. Ugh, Michael, come on. You're graduating in, like, three months. Shouldn't you be coasting? Hey, I am coasting. This just happened to be slightly fun. This is, it's just like a town history thing for civics, you know? So it's forced me to kind of, I don't know. And I mean, it's funny, I don't know if I even want to be here next year. It's just all so flat. Same people, the same expressions. Well, if you leave, I'd certainly miss you. Yeah, no, I'd miss you too. It's just that 
Everybody here knows me, you know? I know you think I have it on Easy Street, but people looking at you all the time, wanting evidence that it's good, that they lived here, that good things can happen to people that are from here, it can get to be a real drag. Like, how about somebody else be captain of whatever for once? Give me a rest. Just don't put so much pressure on yourself, Michael. Who cares what they think? You're gonna... You're gonna do what you're gonna do. I'm gonna do what I'm gonna do. Yes, I will. Uh, let's head back before Karen strands us here. You know, when we saw Uncle Pete last month, I wanted to ask him, because he, he got out moving to New York. And I asked him if it was hard leaving. Know what he said? Oh, God, Michael, I have no idea. I mean, knowing Uncle Peter, he was probably three sheets to the wind. He said the hardest part was deciding what to take with him and what to leave behind. I thought it was, I don't know, for him, <laughs> kind of almost touching. Oh my, how profound. I can't believe Uncle Pete's a mere failed actor and not teaching philosophy at Berkeley. Oh, shut up. <laughs> I cannot believe I had to pick you up from the police station because of Grand Theft Auto. I mean, that is too funny. <laughs> <sighs> yeah, yeah, whatever, man. Alex? Stop it. Just stop. Ugh. You got, you know, you went bad again? I couldn't get you out of it. We should really, we should get this done, now. I'm fine. Let's, we can go. Let's go. Come on, it's all right. I think I can hear Ren and Nona down there. Just don't say anything to them, okay? This is... It's just like a trial period. Hey, like... secret secrets are no fun unless you share with everyone. What is it? Reveal yourselves. We're dating. We're dating. Nona and I, we're gonna date. Rin, dude, what did I just say? What? They asked. Right? You asked? Ugh. Mazel tov on the happy couple. <laughs> Thank you. No. Stop. It's one date at the Revival Theater. We're just gonna sit quietly in the dark and watch a documentary on Bosnian genocide. Hmm. Romantic. Uh, cool. I'm guessing that this was Nona's idea. Hey, I gave him a choice. It was either this or volunteer at an animal shelter that only keeps frenzied possums. Anyways, I know it's stupid to be planning or whatever for this, but I don't know. I just feel like maybe it's not that insignificant, or whatever. Whatever. Truly the language of love. <laughs> Shut up, you know what I mean. Good, I'm glad. This is... I mean, at the very least, I'll get to hear embarrassing stories, so... I... I want to get this off my chest. Just... something happened to us tonight, Alex. Something broke. I don't know if it was the ghost or whatever, but... you've been acting like... not you. Ren. No. I just... Ren, are you... This is what you want to tell me before we go in there? I know. I'm sorry. It's, it's, just been, it's just been a crappy night. I don't even know what I'm saying. This is stupid, but can we, like, take a picture? Why? I don't know. In case things go bad and... Yeah, let's do it. We're on a beach. Kind of. Let's keep a shred of normal here. All right, let's take it. Alex, get in here. You're not getting a... All right. Once we're in there, the door won't open again since the system's so convoluted. So make sure you're ready to finish this before we go inside. I am 
mind coming with you, you know? Yeah, yeah. Oof. Okay. I... Uh, all right. We'll be back. Oh, I know. Listen, Alex, I don't want to say anything to Ren or Nona, but the truth of it is I'm not feeling too awesome right now. It's kind of getting worse. No, no, come on, Jonas. We've, we've cleaned the whole house. Nobody wants to scrub the toilet, but it's got to be done. It's got to be done before we can fall on the couch and watch cartoons, okay? Hey, what do you call a man who's short of time? Huh? Have you heard this one? Is this a joke? Yeah, it's a... What do you call a man that's short of time... Tim. You call him Tim. <laughs> oh. <sighs> yeah, it's not one of my finest. It's kind of spooky, right? The beds? Thinking they would have slept here while the rest of us burned? Yeah, but do you think it would even have worked? Like, if, if Yugoslavia or whoever dropped an A-bomb on their heads. <sighs> Too late now anyway. They never got to try it out. It's... It feels like wrong to see one of these when we're not in a, a time loop, right? <laughs> yeah, it kind of does. Wait, before... Look, if something happens on the other side of this door, just don't be stupid. Cut and run, okay? If I turn into dead weight or start freaking out... Jonas, we're all getting out of here. I mean, look, we're about to fix this in two minutes. Two minutes. This is microwave popcorn of a problem. I'm not asking, I'm telling. Okay, Mr. Dramatic, will you just shut up and help me with the door? Wait, 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 wait. Okay, you know what? There, there's like the tenth time we've heard this song all night. There is something going on with... Like, why would this specific tune be all over the place? Okay, if it'll make you feel better, we'll investigate the case of Jonas's mom's weird song before we save our lives. Sounds perfect. It's like breaking or something. Can you... can you fix it? I mean, it... It's, it sounds like it's her, like a recording, or it's just, it's my mom. That's her voice in the static. You can hear that, right? I mean, I know you don't know what she sounded like, but you can hear that, the voice, right? I can kind of hear it. Is it possible? Do you, th do you think it's possible? I mean, we've been, like, talking with ghosts the entire night. Do you think it's like it could be, right? It's just, w with everything that's happened, she could have come here. It's possible. I mean, a lot's happened tonight in this general realm of craziness, so I'm not going to rule it out. God, she's like so close. You can just... Can you just try and tune in the signal? This tape player thing isn't even... I have no clue what's going on, but... Uh, sure. I, I can... I can try, I guess. Yeah, because this... I don't know how to get this clearer or whatever. I just can't... I just can't really get this to change or... Uh, Mom, can you... Uh. Mom? Whoa, uh... Jonas, don't! <sighs> oh no...